we waiting for the doctor? Yeah. Good morning, world. Good morning, internet friends. Good morning, everybody. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. Anxiety when sleep is not your friend. We've been adding on to the list all day today. Good morning, internet friends. How are we doing today? How are we, Miss Sassy Girl? Say, I'm not feeling too good. I've been throwing up for a little bit, so I'm not a happy puppy. And how are we today, Mr. Immorel? I'm playing with my lightsaber. So, today I am taking Immorel to the doctor for his nine-week shots. Yay! I may also see if I could go ahead and get him microchipped. And then, what else? I know I'm supposed to be going with my dad at some point to get hay, so that should be fun. Oh, and let me show you guys this shirt. It says, Bandard! Suit up or shut up. I haven't worn this shirt in a long time, so it's a little bit tight, actually. But, I love it. It has my instrument on one sleeve, and on the other sleeve it has my graduating class, so... Yay, I feel old wearing this, but I still really like this shirt. So, yeah. Just getting ready, and then gonna go to the vet and get somebody shots, and I will check back in with you guys later. Are we waiting for the doctor? Yeah. Yeah, I was 15 pounds today. That's a lot. Such a good boy. Such a good boy. Hey guys, there's Miss Sassy doing what I'm wanting to do nap. And there's Emeril chewing on his chewy. I am so tired. I was napping and now I can't get back to sleep because that means I can't watch the baby and make sure he's not going to chew on everything in my room. I'm having to keep him from chewing on the couch and the wooden chest that's right there and the floor. He likes chewing on my carpet for some reason. So, despite being really exhausted and just wanting to go back to bed, I'm up. But, I am watching some YouTube videos to try to stay awake. I need to get stuff worked on, like vlog and um, ordering some stuff from MRL on Amazon. And um, registering him on Petlink since he got microchipped. Um, the vet office trip was good. He cried in the car the whole time, so if you guys have any tips on how to make a puppy used to being in a car, then please comment down below and let me know your tips. Because he cries, he tries to climb up on my center console, but I mean, he's not out of control, but he needs to act better in a car, especially since it's dangerous for me to have to constantly be like pushing him back while I'm trying to drive. So, yeah. Get to the doctor, sign in. He sits on the bench, and he he's just a good boy. He sits there quietly. Um, we did a little bit of training. He did a lot better about not chewing on his leash. And, of course, he got a lot of love from the receptionists. Yeah, the receptionists really like you. Where's your Chewy? It's under the couch. There you go. He even has some lipstick on his head from where one of them kissed him on the head. It was actually kind of cute. Um, got into the doctor's office. And I know I mentioned this already earlier. He weighs 15 pounds now, which is great. I was worried about him not gaining weight, even though he doesn't physically look like he's not gaining weight. But I guess that's just another wonderful anxiety thing. Thinking that my dog isn't gaining weight when he has gained six pounds. So, fantastic. Um, he got vaccinated. He got microchipped. I'm going to be saving up money for his neuter. Which will be in March. As far as I know. Because he needs to be around five and a half months. So, hooray. And now I know how much that is. Which isn't too bad. 
the vet absolutely loved him. He's a guy that I've known for a long time. I used to shadow him. He used to work with horses at one point. So he was our equine vet. He was Dr. Richmond is the best. And of course he loved MRL. Everybody that met MRL today loved him. Um and actually one person, one lady, instantly recognized him as a Weimariner. Um, a couple of people like asked what he was. And one of them could see him being mistaken for a golden retriever because his ears are kind of wavy. But one lady instantly was like, I've not seen a long-haired Weimariner in a while. So that was pretty cool. Educate a lot of people about long-haired Wymies and that they exist. Um, I told them that he is in training. And it was funny. A couple of, like, one of the, the lady I was talking to who also um, knew what breed he was, when I was mentioning, like, that he's about, to, that he's training to be a service dog, because I have to explain that to explain how he got his name. And she was like, oh, you're going to make a great service dog for someone. And I'm just like, he already is. I'm just like, well, I guess whenever they say that the dog is being trained, that they assume that it's not your dog. Um, but one of the vet techs I knew very well, worked with her for a long time. I told her to, and she thought it was great that he was going to become a service dog for me. And wished us luck. And everybody said that he has a great temperament for a service dog, which I'm impressed with. He really showed that today. Oh, and he also got to try, like, squirt cheese from a can. And he loved it. It was cute. Because to do a fecal sample, like, instead of holding the dog down like I've been used to doing at another vet's office, they just squirted him a little pile of cheese. And, you know, he ate the cheese. They did their thing. Whatever. And he was happy. He loved the cheese. What are you doing? What are you doing? <gasps> do you want your chewy? Now are you getting tired? Lord, puppy. You are complicated. I love you, though. I do. So, um... I guess now that I'm awake, I'll actually get stuff done. I know I want to eventually go and get some caffeine. I'm an addict. I think I've realized this. Actually, I've known that. And then I'll be seeing Jonah Bug and Allison later, and I'm so excited to see them. So, yeah, that's how the day is right now. So, just wanted to check in with you guys and tell you how the doctor's visit went, and I'll check back in with you later. Hey, guys! Well, there goes Riddler. Emeril, come here! Emeril! Riddler, come! Come here! Come here, Riddler! Little butt. Hi, sassy girl, all bundled up in the blanket. So, I had fun with the Ogo, and of course I played with Allison. We did like this pancake game, we played Candyland, this sung Frozen, um, played with Play-Doh. And I want to show you what Jonah got me for Christmas, or rather it's what he got MRL for Christmas. First item that I've already had him use is these little bones, which is so sweet. Emeril already loves them. He's already chewed up one of them, which the only downside is these are a little bit smaller than his chewy, so I'm going to have to really keep watch on him whenever he has them. Second item is this cute little reindeer that is squeaky. He hasn't seen this yet, so we're waiting on that. And then the third is this Kong-like thing. Gorilla. So I'm excited about having a Kong product. Or it looks like a Kong. Oh, apparently it has actually been tested on by chimpanzees. So exciting! Is it by Kong? No. Apparently yours drooly. Suitable for medium dogs 15 to 35 pounds. And a little bit is 15 pounds, so there you go. But yeah, now we're at home. I'm about to work on the vlog and also get some stuff on Amazon because I haven't done that. I got addresses written down for Ariel and Jordan's presents and I'm going to go get those shipped tomorrow. 
So that's the evening right now. So just wanted to let you guys know what's going on. I'll check back in with you later. Hey guys, there's Mr. Emeril, which on the live stream on Instagram, it was kind of funny because I showed my face. Hi buddy. And someone was like, where's Emeril? And I'm just like, well, fine. There's Emeril, he was sleeping. Hi Riddler. And hi sassy girl. So, um, got the vlog up. I have ordered from Amazon a service dog in training cape for mm. little bit. Right. It's black. Right. It won't fit him for too, too long, I don't think, but at least it'll get him used to wearing a vest until he's old enough to have his own vest. He already has a girth of 17.5 inches. Boys! Really? I'm trying to vlog and you two are being rude. Look at these two. Are you serious, boys? Why? Ah, oh, you boys are weird. So that is on its way, and I'm pretty excited about that. And I've asked the seller, apparently the seller is really good about if you're wanting a different patch, that if you just ask them, they'll do it. Like some people, because it comes with a so Riddler, hush! Enough. Stop. So, the, pa the vest comes with a patch already sewn on that says service dog. I've seen where people want, have requested to have ESA or therapy dog, and the company will do that. So, I have requested to have in training instead of service dog since, you know, he's in training. So, yeah. And now, I'm so tired. So darn tired. I'm ready to go to bed. Oh, dumb anxious thought of the day. I forgot to take a shower tonight. And now I'm freaking out about having to take it in the morning. Why? I don't know. It's dumb. I'm also thinking about taking supplements to help with my memory because my memory loss is really annoying me. I'll forget tasks that I'm doing. Um, I got really annoyed because I forgot how to get to somebody's house. And that drove me up a wall. So... I'm going to probably research what supplements would be good for um, my memory because I'm really annoyed with it. I mean, last time I talked to my mom about my memory loss, she was like, oh, I have that too. It's no big deal. And I'm just like, I shouldn't have this bad of memory loss at 22. I mean, it could be worse. I know that. Like, I remember where I live. I remember who I am. But I have a hard... A much harder time remembering who people are. A much harder time remembering how to get places that I used to know how to get to. And of course tasks where I used to be able to, if I got interrupted from a task, I could just go right back to it, no big deal. Now I can't remember to do that. So it's really irritating and I want to try to fix that if I can. So now with that in mind, it's time to sign up for the night and head off to bed. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world has for you today. Um, question of the day is, what types of meds or supplements do you take? If you have a long list, just pick your favorites, I guess. So I have three types of meds, even though in total I take four. But two of them are for anxiety. One is for sleep slash anxiety, and then one is a birth control. So... Put your answers down below, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Good night, Redlar. Good night, Fluff Butt, as you walk away. Good night, sassy girl.